Hello and welcome to your daily energy report. I'm Ben Lack. As part of Coca-Cola's energy efficiency and climate protection program, it celebrated Earth Day with the installation of five natural gas hydrogen fuel cell servers at its beverage production facility in American Canyon, California. Bloom Energy has developed this new technology and the company has deployed stationary fuel cells that provide electricity at facilities in Elmsford, New York, East Hartford, Connecticut, and Danuba, California. Zotos International, a hair care manufacturer, has completed its 3.3 megawatt on-site wind project, which powers its 670,000 square foot manufacturing plant in Geneva, Switzerland. The project is comprised of two 1650 kilowatt wind turbines and this is the largest wind project of any manufacturer in the United States. Zotos invested in wind power as part of an overall sustainability initiative. Abengoa has partnered with Capital Risco Global for the development of Solana, the largest concentrating solar power plant in the world. The plant is currently being built by Abengoa in Arizona with an expected production capacity of 280 megawatts. It will be the first solar plant in the United States with the ability to store energy. And finally, the Long Island Power Authority is a leader in renewable energy in New York, the Eastern Region, and the nation. To showcase this, LIPA, along with its customers, solar industry professionals, and Enviro leaders, celebrated Earth Day with a number of solar accomplishments, milestones, and new initiatives. The installation of Long Island's 5,000 solar roof and the launch of LIPA's Clean Solar Initiative were announced on Earth Day. That's your Daily Energy Report. To learn about these stories and more, please visit us at dailyenergyreport.com and also make sure to check out our podcast on iTunes. For the Daily Energy Report, I'm Ben Lack. Thanks for watching.